Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a swatch video of the Disney Villains beauty books. They are Walgreens exclusives. Um, they are $9.99 each and I just love the packaging on these. So, um, First I want to say uh, my lipstick looks orange in my viewfinder so I'm hoping it's not quite as orange on camera. But it's supposed to be more of a red. It is the NYC Expert Last lip color in traffic jam it I don't know it's looking orange in here but I don't know if it's orange on camera so we'll see but anyway I'll go ahead and get started I'll do the evil queen first first this is how the package looks gorgeous and on this side it says evil queen and it has a little crown a little shiny crown there it says beauty book in the back just kind of has that it kind of tells what's in it um, or it tells the ingredients of what is in it and it's called, it's the Disney Villains Cast a Spell Beauty Book. Love it. And this is what the inside looks like. It comes with a little mirror. And it folds out to have the, um, the looks that you can do, try to make, or recreate. Um, and the, let me peel this back. I've already done a look using this book here, so it's been swatched already, but, or used already. That's the inside. You get nine eyeshadows. You get nine eyeshadows, a, it, it's calling it a pressed powder, but it looks like a bronzer, kind of orangey bronzer, and an eye pencil, lip gloss, and I believe this is like a shadow pencil, and then you get a brush, and the brush is really cute. I haven't used the brush, but it's, it's um, a little bit fluffier than like the e.l.f. eyeshadow brushes, and it has like, um, this one has like a little crown at the bottom. I thought that was so cute. So that um, and one thing I did notice that when I did use this book is the bottom three are they look very shimmery when you look at them I don't know if you can see but it's like an overspray and when you get in it there's hardly any shimmer in it once you put them on your eyes it's very dis disappointing because look how pretty those are so I'm gonna go ahead and start swatching some of these like these two you probably won't be able to see on me but we'll try anyway. I did actually use this on the look I have on right now. Uh, my lip color has changed but these the top row is very hard to see. The top row is called Magic Spell, Pure Evil, and Black of Night. Here are the colors here. Let's see we got they're backwards from what they are in the pan. <laughs> but um, Magic Spell, Pure Evil, black of night and you can barely even see those but they're pretty much a satin they're not um, they're not matte and they're not they don't have any glitter in them and there's no really no shimmer to them so it's the first three okay the next set I went ahead and did the rest of them on here um, this is cauldron dungeon scream of fright curse Evil Beauty, Her Highness, and then the pressed powder they're calling it is called Trickery. And let's see. I need an extra hand. Okay, so this first one here, let's see, I'll just hold it like here. This one is Cauldron Dungeon. Scream of Fright, Curse, which is like the gold, Evil Beauty, Her Highness, which is the purple, or the kind of the mauve purple, and then this is the pressed powder, which is called Trickery. And as you can see, these are, these are the bottom three, and when you first look at them in the palette, they are very shimmery, but as you can see, they're, they're shimmery, but they're not like glittery shimmery like the palette made them look like they were. It was just an overspray. So. Still very pretty colors, and like I said, I did this look with it today, so that worked out. I used the um, Trickery as a bronzer instead of a pressed powder, because obviously that's way too dark for my skin as a powder. So, let me wipe this off and I'll show you the lip gloss. We got the eyeliner, the lip gloss, and the shadow pencil, I'm thinking that is. Um, 
So with the eyeliner, it's just a black pencil eyeliner. The lip gloss is a clear gloss with a little bit of tint to it. And then the shadow pencil is like a gold. The shadow pencil, I had to really press hard in order to get any color. I mean, that was just one. I really had to build it up to get any kind of good color out of it. So, so I don't know if I like that very much. And it's got the cute little crown on it. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, there we go. And it's just, it's called, the color is called Vein. And it's just like a gold. The lip gloss, it's got just a little, little tube with the black. And it is called Poison Apple. I'm just trying to jump, but it's called Poison Apple. And the eyeliner is called Dark Shadows. So, that is it for the Evil Queen book. The next book is the Maleficent book, and it's the Disney Villains Cast a Spell Beauty book, and that's the cover. How pretty are these? Just love those. And this one has Beauty book, Maleficent, and it has a little dragon. It is purple. So cute. And then you open this up, and you have the mirror right here, and then it's got the little dragon, and then those are the looks that you can do with that. I just love the detail of around, you can see around here, it's all very pretty. Shiny. <laughs> I like shiny things. This one, you get nine eyeshadows, you get a brush, you get, see they're calling this a blush, and liquid eyeliner, lipstick, eye primer. Same thing with the last one. This one and this one I used, and they are oversprays, and just... It would have been so pretty if they weren't, but I mean they're still pretty, but they would have been even prettier. And I can't tell, like in my viewfinder again, the colors are off. This looks like a dark blue, but it's actually a dark purple. So I'll go ahead and swatch these. So for the colors of these, this first one's called Slumber. This one, I think it's called Slided, but I can't really read it. It's so tiny. I can't see it, but um, Vanish, Fairy, Flame. Spindle, Dragon, Spellbound, and Bramble. And here are the colors here. Let's see. Slumber. This is that second one. I couldn't tell what it was called. Um, Vanish. Fairy. Flame. Spindle. Dragon. Spellbound. And bramble and sorry about my little thing there but um, spellbound this one and dragon and this one they all had an overspray of glitter and they're not very there's somewhat shimmery but not really there's a little bit of glitter in them but not as much as like it had on the uh, top of them that green is really pretty though and I don't know if you could tell, but I love shimmery eyeshadows. And these are pretty. I just kind of wish there was just a little bit more shimmer to them. So, those. For the other things in the palette, we have a blush, an eyeliner, lipstick, and a eyeshadow primer. And these two are super hard to get out of here. I kept feeling like I was going to tear this thing or something. But this is the blush. It's called Evil Enchantress. And it is so pretty. Look at that. That is the liquid eyeliner. It's just a simple black. That's the lipstick. The lipstick is called Revenge. And look how cute this little thing is. It's just like a little thing. It doesn't twist up or anything. That's all you get. But it's just so cute. And it has like the little flame there. I hope you can see. But yeah. That is so pretty. And then the, uh, the eyeliner has that little detail on it too and so does the uh, primer and the primer I put on here is just like a nude color that kind of blends out but yeah so look at that blush the blush is so pretty so that is the Maleficent and I did a look using this I actually did it on Emily 
and I filmed it. So if you want to see that, just comment down below and let me know. Um, of course, I know she's just a child, but we uh, we just play. We don't, I don't let her go out in the makeup unless she's at a dance competition or something. But um, yeah, so we just play with the play with the makeup, and she takes it off before we go out anywhere. So here we go. Okay, so I ran out of space, so I had to stop, and so if the angle is different, that's why. But um, first thing I want to say before I move on to the last beauty book is that um, I was doing swatches while I was waiting for my camera to get the um, movies off. Um, I redid another swatch of the, um, this is of the Evil Queen, and like I said before, how they have the overspray, but this one here is called Curse, and the overspray was very gold and shimmery, but when you get down in it, look at the different of color. You can kind of see around the outside how gold it is, but this is like a, um, like a taupe tan color, almost has like a grayish tone to it but it's like so much different from the overspray. It's very upsetting because I, I, I love the gold. I thought the gold was so pretty. So, Which I mean that's an okay color but it's not the one that you're expecting to get. These, This one is, you can kind of see the overspray around the edge on this one too. It's not quite as different of color but it is a little bit lighter. More of a pinky instead of like the purple that's around the edge there. So I just wanted to know let you guys know that. So um, Now I'm going to go ahead and get into the Ursula book and this is what the front looks like and if you hear noise in the background it's Emily. She's making her little snack. So, but here is that. I love the artwork again. It says Ursula beauty book and it has a little shell. And then this one has the mirror again. You can see. And then that is the look she so can make. There's two different looks. And I have not used this, have not swatched this at all yet, so um, these two here are very shimmery, glittery. Um, I was very excited about those, but now I'm not because I'm thinking it's just an overspray, not going to be quite as pretty, so I'll go ahead and swatch these. So this one has nine eyeshadows, two blushes, a little small kabuki brush, uh, eyeliner, and a lip gloss. As you can see, it was an overspray. Let's see if I can get the good angle there, but it's not a whole lot different. It's not quite as shimmery as the overspray, but it's the color is a little bit closer, and it does have some of a shimmer to it. Um, and this one was an overspray as well, but that one is still pretty. Um, it's actually a little bit darker than the overspray. I'm trying to get it the good angle where you can see it, but um, you can see it on my hand or my arm. Um, the colors are Vanessa, Trident, Sea Witch, Underwater, um, Nautilus Shell, uh, Flotsam, Dark Waters, Ursula's Lair. This one I really had to build up. I, mean, I was digging my finger in there and it took a lot to build that up. But and this is Jetsam. And I oh, go ahead, I have the uh, blushes. And, Watch my hand too. This is Kiss the Girl, uh, Poor Unfortunate Souls. The eyeliner is called Black Magic, which is actually a silver. <laughs> and then the lip gloss is called Sorceress of the Sea, and it's like an orange. Um, yeah. Okay. So here are the swatches. Um, this is the blushes and stuff. I'll show you that in a minute. But this is Vanessa. Trident, Sea Witch, um, this is the other one that had the overspray, it's called Underwater, and I kind of did this kind of sideways here, but um, Nautilus Shell, I think that's what it's called, uh, Flotsam, Dark Water, Ursula's Lair, as you can see, um, as dark as it is in the pan, that is like very patchy and not pigmented at all. And this one is Jetsam, which is pretty. Um, the uh, Ursula's Water is really pretty. And Vanessa, which is the, the very first one, is really pretty too. Uh, let's see. Some of them look like they have glitters and some of them look matte. 
I'm not sure if the glitters are left over from other swatches or not. So, But for the most part, they look matte except for these two. The uh, ones that had the oversprays and the rest either are a satin or a matte. And for the blush, we got Kiss the Girls is the light pink. Um, Poor Unfortunate Souls is the darker pink. Very pigmented and very pretty. Um, this is the eyeliner. It is a silver. It's pretty. And this is the lip gloss. It's pretty much, it's in the tube, it looks orange. And um, I don't know if you can even see, it is like a clear gloss. As you can see on here, it's pretty much clear. And here's the, br the Kubuki brush. It's a little baby brush. It's got the little shell on it. It's pretty soft, so I don't know if it would be something that you'd be able to use, but yeah. There's that. I'll show you all of them again. So, gorgeous packaging. I just love that. So that is my swatches of the Villains Beauty Books. And I did a look using the Evil Queen. I will upload soon. And I did a look on Emily using the Maleficent one. And I um, might upload that. We'll see how that works. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Okay, I want to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Give me some thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram. Link is down below. And I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.